Hey, what's up? What up? We're going to jump straight into it. Uh, that in here. Probably look all crazy, I understand. But hopefully it'll make sense. You know what? I'm not, I'm not even going to worry about now. We'll go, go ride through everything. We, we got a lot of new things. Go through it quickly. So get used to this screen. Hopefully I'm, I'm trying to to stop not adding any more but i just know one more capillar that we're going to add at some point but we'll get to that so for now got climber snowbank wonderland uh z2o the wrapped ohm snow dog spartacus staked shib um the my i don't even know if i'm pronouncing that correct i have to double check it exchange cross chain capital these are new that has not that have not been i've added since i've seen you last see seven new or yes yeah, seven um cross chain capital scary chain capital multi-chain capital tomb finance geist reaper farm tool to a reaper farm and we'll get to everything really briefly and the last thing we'll do is um collect our money see how much we have on Meyer and reinvest it compound it back in so get the climber and here you also see that because i know how individuals are i know how i am so i'm not gonna begrudge anybody um we'll add the price in as well so we what i'll do is at the end of the video i'll go in and you see i did it after or it's <clears throat> the other day, I'll go after, not the end of the video, but at the end, I'll go in, put all the current price in. We're not going to look at percentages, maybe in the future, figure out an easier way to do this. Um, I used to be pretty sweet in uh, Excel, but it's been a long time, and I'm not sure how much I'm, energy I may spend on trying to uh, uh, go back to having all the functions and everything down pat. <laughs> uh, all right, let's go over to Avalanche. Wonderland. Uh, yeah, I'm going to approve that. You know, I had not approved that already. But let's go with that. Grab that. Oh, um, as well, I added more. Oh, let's copy that right now. Let's go here to Mint. I had um, some time AVEX liquidity. Because I thought that long story, but I had some time AVEX liquidity tokens from here, about a hundred dollars worth, and I claim all this thing. Use that to buy more time, but it's been at five days, so now I'm going in every eight hours or so, or whenever you know, a couple of times a day, and reinvest and claim it with um because. <laughs> I would explain, but I don't want to, you know, people who don't want to go to London trying to make that that long. But as it was doing it, I was um, getting it there. So let me put my time in. Wonderland. Color coded is everything so you can kind of have a better sense of what's what. And so Time Wonderland. I minted some time at a time AVAX LP that I created on Trader Joe. So I went to mint. It was here. Went into mint. I had some when I did max. I had an amount. See, I still have a little bit of it still, I guess. And then I was able to mint it. Um, and. Can't, so I'm not going to mess with that. Um, oh, that was just saying, okay, it would, it would override my five days, and I'm not going to worry about that right now. But I meant it, and so now for the next five days, I can either claim the rewards that I'm getting or claim an auto staking. I've been claiming auto staking. And so, so you'll see here that it's in red because I added about 100 in. Um, and this is what the total amount of B1 is all there, so probably I shouldn't. You know, we're not going to get too caught up in this number yet because this is in five days after. Long story, how do these platforms work that what I bought will then be added to my total. So for the next couple of days, I'm able to add the rebase of that. Um, I think it's like a point one two 
a point like a point one two or point one three that I added extra. So any anyway. That is our Wonderland Snowbank. Snowbank, the price has just been falling crazily. Unstake max. What's the price right now? Seven hundred thirty-four dollars. I think this was like thousands of dollars at some point. But this is the long game. You know, they had a a bit of a a, a bit of a misstep with their um, snow dog mean coin, and you know the. Um, Creator developer seem like he's been really um, put a lot of messages on everything, saying, "Look, I messed up, man. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm gonna make it better. I'm gonna make it better." So, some people will buy the dip right now with it. Some people will just see what happens. I'm just gonna ride it out. Um, I'll show you how much the snow dog is worth. You know, you'll see how much that's worth now. Um, so I'll go through now. Am I on the right network? Or it does oh it probably does it. No control. Refresh. Refresh, refresh. I'll talk about that in a second as well. I might as well talk about that now. So earlier I have two younger sons and I set up MetaMask wallets for them. Um both. And you know started some of these little farms going for them and you know teaching them how to do it walking them through the steps and getting them to do it and explaining to them all that about controlling your keys making them watch those videos on metamask that you know i just run through nowadays uh, making them watch them videos wrapped avalanche stays the same so you can copy that this box would be the same Snow dog would be the same. Uh, let's go to Spartacus. That's on Phantom. A lot of the new other things that we have are on Phantom as well, so it works out. I believe that's why I put them in this order, if I'm not mistaken. Something like that. Uh. So no, I, mean, I was telling them that about going through and so, you know, you have to approve to be able to stake something and then you can stake it, but you have to also un approve to unstake it and then you're allowed to unstake it unlimitedly. So I just said, go through, make sure your protocol is just set everything up. So when the time comes, you're not having to waste time doing all these other extra steps. So it's a good thing for you. Here you see Sparta Cadabra is now on their site. And that is going to be a good thing to get in on as well early. None of this is financial advice. None of this is medical advice or any advice in any shape, form, or fashion. It's all entertainment for y'all purposes to laugh because I believe a lot of money has been lost <laughs> in all of these. We'll see what our she... Oh, okay, let's do these other ones first. So Tube Finance is basically a kind of like a... a um, a staking platform for Tomb and T shares. So you Tomb is like the main one you can you can stake Tomb with um, Phantom FTM and earn T shares. So you can buy T shares directly and stake it and earn Tomb. So we're staking T shares to earn Tomb. You see, we earned sixty six cents. This has been about a day. Withdrawal still ain't been possible because it's held for a couple of days for the first, um, I think, 24 hours. May not even been 24 hours yet, or about 24 hours. The APR, not APY, which is if you don't compound, you just put your money in here, it'll go up by um, four times. So you put $100 in here, by the end of the year, it'll be $416. So $1,000 will be $4,160. Uh, 10,000 be 41. So basically that. Now, if you compound it by, so staking this, it pays you out in tomb. You take your tomb, claim it, and um, you can either, there's two ways where you can take that tomb, turn it half, whatever you claim, turn it half into FTM. I gotta remember which ones I'm doing here. <clears throat> 
T-shares is staked. I think I take staking T-shares directly. So I buy T-shares and I stake that. And then I get Tomb and buy more T-shares to stake to get more Tomb. It's a lot of the different things. I get confused which ones I'm doing what with. But this may be the one where I'm doing that. Where I'm buying T-share from Spooky Swap. And staking it with the tomb that I'm earning. And then, of course, I get more tomb, more T-share. Which then, so let's go to show you a little bit of the uh, prices. So the thing about tomb that everyone is supposed to be... Um, that makes it work in the system. It is supposed to always be pegged to one phantom, but it can be go a little bit over a phantom. But if it start to go less than a phantom, then there's protocols set in place to keep tomb on tomb finance pegged to one phantom. So if you go to the cemetery, which is like their uh, first stake, if you this is like a think of it, and we'll talk about this later, a stable coin. If you think Phantom is going to do well in the future, you can look at this as the, to not lose the price of Phantom going up in the future. So if you if you got something that's pegged to the price of Phantom, as they both go up, you won't. If it go up too high, it's this thing called a permanent loss. We're not going into details of that right now. But there is you lose the danger of impermanent loss by having something that's pegged to whatever that coin is that you have a liquidity pool with. And so the liquidity pools from them earn T share, and uh, the liquidity pools from T-Share and Phantom earn T-Share. And T-Share, you will see, so Toom is like close to the price of Phantom. And T-Share, you see, is about almost $15,000. Now, T-Share used to be about $5,000, I mean $500, I think, if you go back, um, you know, it just didn't come out too long ago. But you go back here, it was about... 800 down to 500 dollars and now is at four uh, almost fifteen thousand dollars so t-share you earn that by staking tomb and the reason why tomb is important because if you want you believe phantom is going to go up in the future and you want to protect your, your phantom and earn money on it you can put in liquidity pool on tomb finance and earn t-share which then you can stake you know like i said it's a cycle so that's the tomb and on tomb we have um Point zero zero three nine. Now we probably have some more. Let me see how much we get. Now I'm gonna have to pause as I figure this out. <laughs> okay, so my thinking is one hundred percent that I've earned this much in tomb since yesterday, and I'm gonna allow this. I'm gonna allow this to build up for a couple of days before I buy more T share to stake. So I don't have much, but but the price appreciation has gone from fifty two dollars yesterday that I bought to fifty eight dollars today. If that makes sense, okay. So now we'll move on to Reaper. Yes, Reaper Farm. So Reaper is another just straight up liquidity farm. You provide tokens, a liquidity farm. So I had to go to spooky swap and take well i'll show you where i'm at with it i did it with tomb so i did two tombs one with um phantom or ftm in tomb and another with uh, ftm in shared which is separate from my farm on tomb finance this is i went this is all separate money and i'll show you that in a second and I, I, on Spooky Swap, I created liquidity shares with these, just like I set up with a, a FTM and Tomb one. I'll show you really, what that looked like really quickly. So you go here to Spooky Swap, here to liquidity, and then I said FTM, and I did exactly how they said it there. FTM, and I put in here um, Tomb. And then I had equal amounts of FTM and equal amounts of Tomb, and boom, supplied it, made a liquidity pair. And then I took that liquidity pair here to Reaper Farm, and then I was able to deposit it here to get this yield of 1,300, um, 1,300, 1,300 of APY, I'm sorry, APR. 
and I'll go to that in a second. And then also put one here for T shares. And this one is was at ten thousand yesterday, but it's at nine thousand seven hundred sixty three. So I deposited. I have these LP tokens in here, and on the info you can see that I have. This is how many tokens I have in here. Um, this is the yield on it percentage. So about point uh, seven percent a day. The week about five percent for the week. Twenty four for the month. One thousand three hundred nine for the year. And you know, I guess it's still calculated, but it did show the numbers. Maybe if you sit, let me see if I sit for a sec. I had to refresh the whole page, but now, okay, so you see here, oh, okay, it shot up, the yield shot up. I had to refresh the page, so what I did now is 15, almost 1500 for the year in the um, APR, and the so I had put in, well, let's get this price now, 80, 18. And this is the tomb one, 80, 18. Yesterday, um, I spent $79.63 to put that in. And now that's how much it is. I think my LP stay the same. Oh no, LPs have gone up. So that's my liquidity. Oh, this is auto compounding. So yeah, Reaper Finance. So the reason why you use Reaper Finance is that it auto compounds for you. So while you make the liquidity pair on Spooky, you then put in a Reaper because then it'll take that and every time it gives that money, extra money, it auto compounds it for you, which is dope. So this is the difference I have from yesterday to today, and this is the difference in price. And we'll look at our other one as well. So this one you can see, wow, the APR went up to almost uh, 11,600, not almost, but 11,000, I think 11 to almost 12,000, but. So 1.3 a day, 9.5 for the week, almost 50 for the month. And then I put in like, Eighty dollars in here as well, and it's expected to be eighty dollars. Expected to be ten thousand dollars in a year. Now the the, the amounts are going to go up and down depending on how many people in and out in. But as of now, this is what it is. So we'll get how many tokens they say we have now. Got that. Uh, let's see. It's a little bit higher. And what was the price I wasn't paying attention to? Well, 86.72. Okay, so I went up by six bucks on this. And I guess it was some price appreciation on it, on that. But we are trying to do almost equal for these. And now we'll show Geist. Guys, is similar as you can imagine. It's one of these farms where you just set up, you don't have to do anything. So this literally, it auto, it takes that and auto do it. So I don't have to even get involved with that. Tomb Finance. Every now and then, I'm going to come in here and claim reward and buy T share. And um, I think on here, I had to go to, on Spooky. I would have to turn the T share into Phantom and then with uh, FTM with the FTM buy. Um, T-share because you can't buy directly. I can't remember, I'll, you know, when it's time, I'll do it. So this is not auto. So this is why I was like, you know. And I'll explain in a second with my plan, long-term plan with all of this stuff. But, okay, so guys, very similar. I'm going to hear a stake. I'm just staking. I bought some, a guys FTM. So I went to Spooky Swap and I did that one specifically. Guys on top, FTM, made liquidity pair. Brought my liquidity pair here. And bought my liquidity pair here and um, staked it here. So I have, well, okay, I'll just do that right there. So staked, and I can re invest this back in, but I'm gonna wait to get up to like, you know, five, 10 bucks. We'll see where I'm at. 23.53, is that where I'm still at? 
Is that what I was? Yeah, twenty three point five three, and that was about fifty three dollars and ninety two cents, and now it is at fifty one dollars and eighteen cents. So the price of guys has gone down. Oh, 18. Thought I had that wrong. Okay, so that's going down a little bit. But I have like, what, a dollar or something? And guys, how much was it? 95 cents or one point. So actually, I'll be able to, when I vest that, I'll have add that to there. But I'm not going to count that until I actually do it. So. And that actually had a 95 cent on, which you not going to bring me back to where I'm at. But remember, this is about adding more of these tokens to the mix. We're not going to stick with Geist. Geist is just another platform where you can deposit, borrow, deposit money, borrow money. It's like an Ave for the Phantom Network. You can lend and borrow on there. <clears throat> Oh wow, 20 minutes. This is I, I swear I do not be trying to <laughs> go this long with this. Okay, let's refresh that because that can't be right. He's like these numbers just be going backwards, son. Maybe it's like oh when we first read your, your I mean when we last read your wallet. Alright, so got three over here, got this 37 over here. Maybe this goes over here. I don't know. I'm guessing, like I said, it, 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 sometimes this thing just changes on me. I'm not 100 percent on it, but let's we'll 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 do that. We'll add those numbers together and put that as what we have as our total for the moment. I figured otherwise. All right, so we went with the 851,540.39 for 33.48. We're now going to do. Um, Meyer would just takes a bit to connect. Give me a sec. I had to go back and double check when I set this up. So I set this up two days ago and I put in what? Um, a total of. I think, yeah, about almost two hundred dollars, one hundred eighty eight bucks. And I made ten dollars in two days. So five dollars a day. That is good. So we're going to harvest all of this. Harvest. Oh, unable to harvest smaller than 20. So in two more days, we'll do that. So then we'll we'll harvest and we'll put it back in here at a 66 to 33 ratio. You see, I'm a, I'm a little bit off. So what I may do, if this has come a little bit pronounced, I may put it at 67 max to... I guess I'll do 66, it'd be 34. So I'll do 67, 33 for real and see if I can kind of get these almost closer to equal again. So, but here for now, um, my staked LP is at, still at uh, 0.12. And, okay, let's just put that in. Like I said, boy, uh, $200, $200 making 5% a day. That's what about, 2.5% on your money. And that's just. If the price would be the same, the $10, where am I getting at 2.5? Hold on a second. <laughs> yeah, about how much max I'm earning. That's how I'm calculating it. So, something to think about. Uh, really quickly, here we have these these dashboards that show you a lot. So Zapper, highly recommend using the Zapper. You do the quest here, open quest at liquidity exchange. Oh, you can only do one at a time? Okay, so, oh, this is weekly. So be able to add um, liquidity, remove liquidity, and you get points for it, earn these votes. D Bank shows you what's in your, in your wallets all around in overview. So let me go through. Oh, really quickly. These coins people are calling um, DeFi 3.0. Uh, 
uh, cross chain is on Avalanche, scary chains on Phantom, multi chains on Ethereum, and their reflective tokens, similar to I guess what what a Moon Bank was, where just holding a token in your wallet it goes up in terms of the number that you hold because it takes you buy if you you know and i don't know why people think it's 3.0 it kind of existed when you go back to even proof of weekends where you buy a token they take like a percentage of every buy and sell of the token a percentage of it like 10 percent or 20 percent is taken out of the buys and sales and give it to a treasury that's paid out in these extra token that goes to the token holder so just by holding it you don't have to stay to any type of website or anything just having it in your wallet um these tokens increase so let's go here and look here sometimes things that you had don't even show in your um wallet so don't freak out if you see that because that doesn't show it but here okay now i can see my tokens here and you see they have, the numbers have increased But what I'm going to do is probably go to the um, exchange for each of them and get them. So let me do that very quickly. All right. So these are the totals for today. You can see our climbing is going up. Our snowbank is going up. Well, the price is tanked. Wonderland, even though we added some more in, I just added that in now um, to the new price. It was at 0 0.02 on the thing, but I added the 0 0.1 that we already got. So... Um, we'll see the whole price in a couple of days once it's added in. Arbitrum added a little bit to that as well. So is that 0.81? Our staked home stays the same. Snow Dog stays the same. You can see Spartacus is up. Our staked ship, we believe, is up. This will be up in a couple of days once I re, um, reinvest. Cross chain increased. Scary chain has increased. Multi chain has increased. And tomb, once I reinvest, it will increase. Same for Geist. And Reaper have increased. And these are the prices. But you can see the prices dropped. And at some point, I'll probably do percentages for it. From even just the other day, Snowbank has gone up. A little bit, being that I've also um, rebased every day on that. Uh, Wonderland, everything has gone down the past day or so, so you can't really look at the market for that. So we'll keep an eye on this, see how these new farms go with everything, our new total. So not going to keep you much longer. With that, I love you. You love you. God loves us. And that's all that matters.